Aha, fair use. Fair use. All right, let's get to it. Yo, this man just hit me in my face with a brick, and all these black men just watch, and they don't give a fuck. The brick is. Yeah, this man, is. this man hit me, fucking grabbed a rock, and it hit me in my fucking face, because I would have given him my number. The brick and is. all y'all just fucking watch. What you y'all see that shit? What you y'all see that shit? What y'all want y'all to do? I want y'all to be a man. I want y'all to be a man and fucking do something. Hey, like, what you y'all want me to let do? a man hit me in my face. Man, fuck all y'all niggas. So this this chick here is like uh she 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 this chick here is like totally uh totally totally retarded, right? Uh let's see, uh like everybody got something to say on this. Um let's see, let's see, let's check this out. Internet recently over the weekend there was a woman who was punched in the face with a brick. And there's a second video circulating around the internet showing this same woman slapping the white man in the face and twerking afterwards. Oh, the ghetto culture. To everybody who believe that this witch hunt video is purposeful and justifiable to get hit in the face with a brick, you're wrong. You are wrong. The video does not indicate that he is the person that hit her with the brick, number one. Number two, you use this video as evidence trying to perpetuate the idea that she is a woman of poor behavior, which means that she should be hit in the face with a brick. So let's say in this case, I want to find out at a level of seven. Okay, so I find that level on my graph and I come horizontally to my gradient line. Where it intersects with my gradient line, I'm gonna come straight down to where it intersects with my fuck around line. That there is gonna tell me how much I have to fuck around to find out what I need to find out. See, as you can see, the more you fuck around, the more you're gonna find out. And also, if you stay down here and you never fuck around, you'll never find out. You use this video as evidence trying to perpetuate the idea that she is a woman of poor behavior, which means that she should be hit in the face with a brick. The more you fuck around, the more you're going to find out. Uh, to a point, yes. To a point, yes. If you're out there, bad behavior, and you're trying to get and instigate and in people's face, they're saying she taunted the man to hit her with the brick. I mean. And also, if you stay down here and you never fuck around, you'll never find out. I'm not making this up. We can hear it from the man himself. Uh, let's see. You guys don't even remember who you guys are trying to defend, who you guys are trying to speak up for. This is the same woman that was going around smacking white people in the streets. She's not innocent. She was actually taunting the guy to hit her. Why would I go defend somebody that's actually looking for trouble? That part. She was taunting the guy. That's an eyewitness statement. She was taunting the guy. Now, I'm not saying that she deserved to get hit with a brick. If you stay down here and you never fuck around, you'll never find out. Second off, the point is, she's trying to put this on all black men. When there were no black men involved. Those are immigrants from Africa, Haiti, or whatever. They're not black till they get to the U.S. They're not black. They're not black American men. They're trying to put this because we all know when they say black, they mean black American men. That's what they mean. So uh, we're not falling for it at all. You know, so let's get back to it. This woman, she is literally a troublemaker. Everybody that knows her in our community knows she's a troublemaker. I'm not gonna risk my life over somebody that's actually out there looking for trouble. That part. If you go on social media online, you're going to see some of her antic videos, taunting people, looking for a reaction. Well, she got what she's been looking for, and you guys are giving her the attention that she was actually speaking for. I don't regret not standing up for her. If you look at some of the videos, I was there. I don't regret nothing whatsoever. I don't regret standing up for her. I'm not saying she deserved it. I'm not saying that any men have a right to hit a woman, especially with the bricks. Huh. 
All white bricks, all white bricks, white tan bricks, just hit a lick for 50 more bricks. Huh? Nobody deserve that. By the end of the day, there's more to the story. She's not as innocent as she trying to portray herself to be. Still, it's been 12 hours. I'm in the hospital. I'm getting discharged. I do have a concussion, so I gotta take it slow for the week. Unfortunately, I don't have the kind of job that's gonna give me that kind of grace. So, you know, I still got a mother. I still gotta teach. I still gotta work. <laughs> I really just want the best for everybody, and I don't know why people want to kill me. See, as you can see, the more you fuck around, the more you're gonna find out. <laughs> I can't even chew food the next week. <laughs> I had a vacation that I planned six months ago for my birthday. I'm so afraid, like, I'm so afraid, like, why do people want to hurt me so bad? The more you fuck around, the more you're going to find out. <laughs> I really love my community and just to know that, like, people hate me to this level. She wants attention. She's an attention sicker woman. She tried to go viral, and you guys have given her what she wanted. Yes, yeah, she get. Yes, she did get hit by a brick. Yes, I saw it. Yes, I was standing by doing nothing. And if that shit happened again in the same circumstances, I would watch her because she's not as innocent as she portrays herself to be. She was taunting the guy. She was calling him all type of names. She was degrading him to a point where he resulted in picking up a brick and hitting him. I don't condone that type of behavior, but once again, she's not as innocent as she portrays herself to be. I literally, like, I remember a while back, she's posting videos going around in public, literally smacking old white people in the face. This is for the uh, fact that you're a white man and I'm a black woman. I have less privilege than you. Thank you. Oh, I feel bad, man. <laughs> we're all, we're all the more you fuck around, the more you're going to find out. For what? And now you get hit by a brick, and now you want to cry wolf? No, I don't care. If you, you want in trouble, you got trouble. That's why I'll still buy and watch. That's why I'll still buy and watch. That's why I'll still buy and watch. The more you fuck around, the more you're going to find out. Still buy and watch. So don't, oh man, that got me upset. <laughs> you look for trouble, you found So what y'all think? What y'all think about homie? Y'all think he should? Look, you, you look for trouble, you found it. Uh, I gotta throw one of the fuck around find out uh, scales in here. So let's say in this case, I want to find out at a level of seven. Okay, so I find that level on my graph, and I come horizontally to my gradient line. Where it intersects with my gradient line, I'm gonna come straight down to where it intersects with my fuck around line. That there is gonna tell me how much I have to fuck around to find out what I need to find out. See, as you can see. The more you fuck around, the more you're going to find out. And also, if you stay down here and you never fuck around, you'll never find out.